Hi folks, it's Mike Murphy, and today's quick tip is an Adobe After Effects CC 2022. In this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to create a paper cutout look. So it looks like you took your graphic or assets, put it on a piece of paper, and then cut around them with scissors. So you get that border or edge. First, create a new composition, and then just drag any graphic or object onto your composition. Next, you need to add the layer below that you're gonna be using to cut around. So in my case, I'm gonna be using this old paper layer. I'm just gonna drag it right onto the canvas. So I'm just gonna click on the paper layer and drag it below the logo layer. You can also just use a solid color below your graphic. So maybe you wanna have white as your edge. To do so, go up to the top menu, go to layer, new, solid, or use the keyboard shortcut Command Y. You can click on the color swatch to pick a color. You can click on the eyedropper tool to select a color. I'm just gonna keep it white. I'll choose make comp size, click okay. Then I'm gonna take that solid layer and drag it below the logo layer. Select the paper layer or your solid color layer, whatever is below your graphic. Then come up to the top menu and click on the pen tool. All you have to do is just click, click, all the way around your graphics. So you can think of this just like cutting out with a pair of scissors, make it as jagged or as smooth as you want. And we're just cutting around. If you wanna make any adjustments, you can just click on any point and you can move them around. Next, we're gonna parent the graphic layer to the paper layer below. So that way, if you make any changes to the paper layer or the logo layer, both layers are gonna change. To parent the layer, just click on this little circular icon here. That's the pick whip tool. Just click on it so we're on the logo layer and I'm just gonna drag it to the paper layer or the solid layer below. And now if we make any changes to the paper, you see they both change. To edit or access the mask that you created around your graphic, just go down to the layers panel and select it and tap on the letter M and that will bring up all masks on your layers. You see, if you do not see the mask transform handles, come down here below the comp window and click on this button right here, toggle mask visibility. When I click that, now you will see the points around the mask. And if you cut out your logo and it didn't look the way that I had it, just click on this drop down and make sure it's selected to add. And to animate this, all I did was select the paper layer or select your solid layer below. Then I went up to the pan behind tool and I moved the anchor point to the bottom of the layer as I wanted to rotate from the bottom. I added a couple rotation keyframes. I added the loop out expression so it would loop endlessly. And that is how to create the cutout look in Adobe After Effects CC 2022. My name is Mike Murphy. Cheers.